Does a personal trainer need to look the part? I have seen a lot of arguing about this topic over the years, and many people don't trust personal trainers that they consider to be out of shape. I've heard sentences like, would you go to a dentist with bad teeth, or would you take financial advice from a homeless person? One study suggested that people were less confident in lifestyle advice when the doctor giving it was obese. I don't believe that a personal trainer's physique is indicative of how good of a personal trainer they are or how much they know. One of the most muscular guys that I have ever met used to ask me for advice. He was an absolute fucking he-man of a bloke, and he was so liberal with his pharmaceutical usage that he genuinely admitted to me that he didn't even know what one of the drugs he was injecting with was. I could train drug-free for the rest of my life, and I wouldn't even come close to being as big as this guy was. As a female example, one of my friends won a bikini contest and admitted that she had only been training for six months. She was naturally thin and athletic, so by her own admission, it genuinely didn't take a lot of work. So compare that to someone who grew up in an overweight family and has lost a lot of weight but isn't stage lean. Which one of them actually has more experience? If one friend had a million dollars and another friend had $50,000, which one would you go to for financial advice? But what if you found out that the one that had a million dollars inherited it all and the one that had 50,000 actually built it up from zero? The person with less money has actually made the most progress. Comparing a snapshot of two physiques doesn't give you any context. Genetics, drug use, past progress, current rate of progress, injuries, medical conditions, or even just personal preference. I know people who are strong and athletic as fuck, but they have zero desire to have a shredded six pack. However, there is an aspect to consider here. Whilst I strongly disagree that a personal trainer's physique is indicative of how good of a personal trainer they are, it does impact how they're perceived by other people. In a recent study, people were shown photos of personal trainers and asked for their perceptions. The endomorphic body type was rated as less competent than the mesomorphic and ectomorphic body type. Muscular personal trainers were perceived to be more competent and more knowledgeable than non-muscular personal trainers. Females were rated as more competent and more knowledgeable than male personal trainers. Interestingly, males also gravitated towards working with male personal trainers, whereas females didn't show a stronger preference either way. So whilst I don't agree that a personal trainer's physique is high up the totem pole of importance, in a gym environment, it is a business card that other people are probably going to judge them by.